Hello friends, good evening. Today I am going to cover some new impactful changes Odoo is bringing in version 19 and that is for allowing to select multiple routes on sales order. So in Odoo, what happens previously when we are going to settings, we enable multi-step routes as well as this new addition like MTO is now available in general setting. Apart from that, when I go to route, then each and every route, now I can able to select sales order line item. So what I have done is buy as well as MTO, I am keeping on sales order line. So now what's happened? Let me create a new product for our example, like my product test. This is my product. Normally, I am not selecting any route over here and then I am just you know what I am doing is on my product <coughs> that is my product test I am also keeping one vendor free and then with its desired price so this is my basic setup if I want to replenish this particular product i can just go and then i can say buy let's say 100 units and system will create a po for me so in purchase order now i can see my product test 100 is done i confirm and i receive those items so this is a very normal transaction now I have enough stock. So any customer is coming and I'm selling that particular product. My product test, I have enough stock available. I can directly maybe sell 10 units and then system will create a delivery order for me and I can deliver the product. However, when certain customers are coming, maybe which have a higher demand, so over here now i have only 90 quantities available but customer demand is 500 quantity so i don't have enough stock so this time i have decided not to touch my available stock but i will create an mto buy order which will create a po automatically from the system and then i can directly assign this 500 units specifically to this particular customer only so i can receive this 500 unit and then when i go to my product and the forecasted unit i can directly see stock in transit like picking is generated for this 500 unit and then stock in transit 10 another unit with another order is there and 90 unit is still available for free so this is how i have directly reserved my available product from the picking itself and then i can deliver directly to my customer from my sales order so let me go to previous sales order it has created a delivery order product is still there in my output location and then in so32 now I have delivery order so once I validate those will go and then from output location to customer location it will be gone. So over here now you can see the my test now 90 units are available. So this is how with such combination you can decide how to replenish that product on the fly based on your sales and demand from customer and the volume of order so this is a very fantastic you know update which we have have got in version 19 to allow to select multiple routes on order we will see down the line in future how this multiple route can help to ease our operations but this is very important to show you how i can select multiple route unlike earlier version i can i was able to select only single route and then it triggers the operations accordingly hope this will help many users to configure their warehouse and replenishment strategy accordingly 
to allow to select multiple route on sales order line. Thank you guys. Good day.